my skin. My skin in a freaking bottle. Like NYX is doing it for me, y'all. If I wrote you a symphony Just to say how much you mean to me what is up y'all it's your girl Ava and welcome back to my YouTube channel if it's your first time here welcome as you can see by the title today we're going to be reviewing the NYX bear with me concealer serum and also their bear with me jelly primer y'all already know before we get into it let's subscribe if you were here for the vibes all the beauty natural hair and lifestyle content which is good for your soul baby nothing but that good energy and positive vibration over here Okay, I am so excited to bring you guys this video today because I've been using this product for well over a month So my review is so authentic and it was so unexpected because this was not bought with the intention of doing a review I really just really come to love this product so much and the things I've learned about this product in this past month is just like Why are you playing with me guy? Like did you really bring me a whole new like I haven't picked up my Fenty foundation since I've incorporated this concealer serum into my routine, which essentially I use it as a foundation. So let's get into this review, y'all. I will be using the NYX Bear With Me Concealer Serum in the color Camel. And then I have their Jelly Primer here, which is, look at the texture, y'all. It is so jiggly, 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 jiggly. Can y'all tell? And no matter how many times I swipe out new handprints, it always, because I've been using it, it looks brand new. It always goes back down to like an even plateau, which we love. It's, it's aesthetic for me. The price points for these products. So I know that the concealer serum, y'all, it is only $11. Honey, I told y'all I put my Fenty down. I haven't touched it since. I got this back in December. It's only $11, y'all. Like, come on. Come on for your doll. I need to Google the price of the jelly. I think that was $15, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, the NYX Jelly Primer is $17 at Ulta, but but this is a, what is it, a drugstore brand, so you can use your coupons at Ulta. Like, they be having like 20% off, $3.50 off, $15 or more, like, make sure y'all use y'all Ulta coupons, okay? But I will have both of these products linked below, so you can go check them out on the website. Y'all, look at the reviews. I'm so excited to do this video today, y'all, because I feel like concealer serum literally has given me what I needed during a time of depression to do my makeup. So, I don't know if y'all understand, like, when you are kind of depressed and not feeling the best sometimes you don't have the energy to do no full beat but this literally take me from like drab to fab it's like in literally a five minute makeup routine so we're gonna start off with the jelly primer you guys I love the packaging too I love like this pink color it's mauve it is so cute y'all I find it best that when I use this I like to use this jelly primer because it's super hydrating if you have oily skin don't let the word hydrating scare you because essentially we think all the time like oh my skin is oily the reason why your skin is overproducing oil is because it's lacking moisture so this is literally what you need and i've also noticed that when i use the concealer serum without the foundation i don't get the same long lasting effect that i do with this when i wear the concealer serum with this primer I literally can use this product just like foundation because it doesn't move, it doesn't separate, it stays there all day. So next y'all, we're gonna go in with the Bear With Me Concealer Serum in the color Camel. Basically what I like to call, people call it color correcting, spot correcting, that's how I use this product. So I'm just gonna put a little bit on the back of my hand. Ooh. And I am just going to go over my dark circle. So this product is really good for color correcting, you know, erasing those dark marks. Acne scars, as you see, I have some right here. I have some from like ingrown hairs on my face right here. It's really good and I have hyperpigmentation. It's really good for hyperpigmentation as well around my mouth. It's, tr I've been treating it, but y'all, it does, it does get a little, the discoloration is no joke moisturizing and this price point is amazing and like i said it is super hydrating but i could never use the word oily to describe this product it is giving what it is supposed to give and like i said i feel like it's a medium coverage but it is definitely definitely buildable this looks like my skin my skin in a freaking bottle like nyx is doing it for me y'all like reviewed their nyx butter glosses and the new shades, like I'm literally in love. And the way I like to pat it in under my eyes, I like to take this, this Real Techniques brush and I like to use the side of the brush to pat it in underneath my eyes. And I find 
that is how I get the most coverage out of this product instead of stifling it in like I did everywhere else just particularly under the eyes that works very very well look at that look at that it looks luminous but i promise y'all by the time we get done if you're into that matte look you're gonna have the matte look baby you could stop here right with the concealer serum i think it's a great alternative to like like y'all remember bb creams and tinted moisturizers i don't think i was a part of the era of makeup that wore bb creams and tinted moisturizers i'm just very familiar with them I could leave the house like this. I could literally set my face with a little bit of setting powder under my nose, on my forehead, my T-zones, and then I could put some setting spray and I could walk through the door just like this for a good even foundation. I think this looks exactly like my freaking skin and I love that. But we're gonna do a full beat today just because this is what your girl is in the mood for. While I tell you more about why I love this product, because when I say I love it, y'all, I'm not like even trying to guess y'all to go buy it. Like I really love it. Lately y'all, I have been on like really big on budgeting. So I also bought these the same day I bought the concealer serum because I never seen it before. I didn't know if I was gonna like it, but I'm going to conceal over this. They give me that, look how it's starting to dry down and my face is starting to a little mattify a little bit. It looks amazing. My memory card was full. Everything is happening during this video. But like I say, y'all, I'm just going in with my Fenty foundation, my Fenty powder foundation to kind of just go ahead and put a little bit of powder on my neck to kind of just for the sake of this video you look at me my face and my neck and my arms are the same color but I always had hyperpigmentation on my neck since I was a little girl and I just recently it doesn't really bother me but I just recently started to work on trying to correct it like using products to kind of lighten that area but at the same time it's kind of just like it's a genetic thing, like my dad has it, my sisters have it. So a part of me take a little bit of pride in that, like this is who I am, like a birthmark or something, you know what I mean? Well, I do, I don't think it's like confidence damaging, but I do think aesthetically it's more pleasing when everything is in unison, right? I'm gonna go ahead and finish up my makeup, y'all, while I continue to tell y'all about how much I love these products. Just to show y'all how quick you can get your makeup done with just this as a foundation. Y'all, I'm using the NYX Can't Stop, Won't Stop concealers in the colors warm honey which is the lighter color and mahogany and i just mix these two together because the day that i went to purchase these products they didn't have my shades so i just bought two of the shades that were similar that the shade lighter and the shade darker or something like that something like i did something to try to make a shade that i knew i would like and it low-key worked I'm probably like, girl, you buttoning out your concealer with a brush? Yes, I am. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna speed up this part of the video because I can't talk to y'all and do this at the same time. It's just too much for me. If I wrote you a symphony Just to say how much you mean to me What would you do? If I told you you were beautiful Would you date me on the regular? Tell me, would you? Well, baby, I've been around the world but I ain't see myself another girl like you. This ring here represents my heart. But there's just one thing I need from you. Say I do. Because I can see us holding hands, walking on the beach, our toes in the sand. I can see us on the countryside, sitting on the grassland side by side. You could be my baby. Let me make you my lady. Now that I blended out this concealer, I'm going to go in with my True Complexion Loose Setting Powder by Black Radiance in the banana color. And I'm going to go in with my Fake Tea Setting Powder in the color Hazelnut. And what I like to do is I like to mix these two babies together. So this is what it looks like. I almost, so I'm just going to give it a little stereona. And I'm going to set my concealer with this powder. So I press it in. I don't really bake. It's not really my thing. You can set your whole face with that if you'd like to. Now that I've set my face with the Fenty and the Black Radiant setting powders, I'm going to use my Fenty powder foundation in the color 440. The same thing I used on my neck and I'm going to kind of pre-contour. So I'm going to use this brush shape like this and I'm just going to 
and an upward motion kind of just push it in so and I'm just gonna kind of contour with this color and this sweeping motion I feel like just avoids me from getting those really harsh lines because one thing about women who are chocolate not that you cannot contour with darker gray ashier colors I just feel like your skin is the contour you know what I'm saying so baby make sure you're really getting in with those undertones and those colors that match your natural skin foundation y'all look how amazing this looks I love 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 how this looks I'm gonna go back in with my Fenty powdered foundation and I'm just gonna go ahead and contour my nose very lightly nothing too major and last but not least as far as skin goes I'm going to go in with the duo I guess I'm going to my store. It's $1.99. I'm going to go with this darker color. And just here on my cheekbones where you see I have like a natural indentation right here. I'm just going to go ahead and deepen that up just a little bit. Just a little, little, little bit. So I'm going to go in with this darker color very lightly and do that same method with the upward padding. Y'all see that? Same thing over here. And last but not least, I'm gonna set my face with the Morphe setting spray. Can we, can we get into her real quick? What? Y'all look how my makeup looks so bomb. Give me a minute, I'll be right back. <laughs> I just realized I've been recording this video on the wrong setting. Hopefully the footage came out amazing and I don't have to re-record this y'all. We love the Bear With Me Concealer Serum by NYX and I would rate it a 9.5 out of 10. The reason why I guess a 9.5 is because it's a medium coverage and it's built but it's buildable so you know there go your 10 points if you really really want to be technical about it. I love the way the primer works with the serum concealer. It's an amazing hydrating primer. It really, really gets into it, y'all. Like, I am loving my finished, my final look. I hope you love it as well. Comment, and you guys, I'm gonna leave the links down below where you can purchase these products. They're super affordable, great for spot treating acne scars, dark marks, hyperpigmentation, amazing for dry patches on your face. I've been struggling with that this winter, especially under this eye right here. Love, love, love this product. And I will see you guys in my next YouTube video. Peace.